It's time. I'm here with Jeff Glover, who's actually fighting in a super fight tonight. Jeff, we do comedy in the podcast. We have to ask, what's it like to be a jiu-jitsu personality in addition to a pretty badass competitor? Um, well, I don't know. Life could be worse. I wake up and do things I want to do. Um, I choke people for a living. People pay me to choke them. I mean, yeah. you're also really good at it too. You change it up in the mat a lot. You do different things. What can we expect tonight in the super fight? Are you helicoptering in or anything, or coming in from the rafters? I actually thought about coming in like Hulk Hogan and just like ah, rip my shirt off and then putting my rash guard on after the display of strength. <laughs> this uh, sun's out, guns out. Um, I uh, that would be good. You yeah. should do that. You actually, I might do that. I might yeah. do that. I kind of wanted some walkout music. I don't know if they're going to let anybody else do that. Um, I don't know. That would be cool. Some Eminem, you know, come out with, like, my hood on. Absolutely. Like a big, like, like New York jacket, you know, just like. This is L.A. Surely we can find someone to walk behind you with a giant boom box. Oh, I have a posse, dude. I have a posse that will beatbox for me, as a matter of fact, in harmony, you know, so I can walk out to that shit Gracie Train style. We are going to be following you then. Now you've heard it. Jeff Glover's got stuff planned tonight. You're a man amongst the mixed martial arts community. What's it like to see all the jujitsu reaction here at the expo? Uh, this is awesome. Uh, Hanzo Gracie's the man, dude, you know, putting this together here. I mean, all the best people are here. Lovato Jr.'s here. Uh, Hodger Gracie was here. I mean, <clears throat> Bruno Malfacine, all the guys doing the super fights, Kyle Terra, all the best dudes in the world are here coming together, you know, talking jujitsu, telling stories, you know, exchanging numbers, you know, just doing bringing the community together like we need. We need to do this more often. Um, and it's awesome. It's cool to get to, you know, see these people again that, you know, you don't always get to see and, like, see new jiu-jitsu. I've already learned a bunch of new moves from yesterday, so. You've learned new moves. All the time, yeah. Okay, Jeff Glover's even learning here. So if you're not oh, at the jiu-jitsu expo, you're yeah. missing out. Everybody's learning. All the best guys, they're the best because they, they are not stagnant. Every time they compete, they're trying something else. You know, like, it may, like, like, you know, a variation on something they're really good at. You know what I'm saying? That's that's how it's always going to be. That's why you got to be down with the the kids. You know what I'm saying? You got to be like cool with the next generation. You can't hate on the next cool move that some young kid's doing at the tournament and be like, oh, that won't work on me. Or like, blah, blah, blah. That style is like, you know, whatever. That's not what my coach taught me. Like that's that stuff. Those guys don't ever last too long. Jeff, can I ask a question? Because now you've kind of got me thinking. Have you thought about running for Congress at all? I think you'd be really good at it. Oh gosh, no. That, oh, I don't know. Maybe that would be we'd tough. be. We need a fresh take. People aren't going to argue with you in a committee hearing meeting. I would, I would encourage people to have jujitsu matches to yeah. settle debates. I don't know, arm wrestling matches. Maybe that's that's what we need. Maybe that's what this country needs. That's how they used to wrestling. do it in the real days. Like back in the old days, they fought when they disagreed. I, I love it. Andrew Jackson style. I don't know. That's, now we're talking. Yeah, well, I don't know. Jeff Glover, thank you so much for stopping by and talking to us. Hell yeah.